Hello mates, I am Kiran Jadav here. In this session, I will teach you Spring Boot with Auth 2.0 implementation. See what is Auth? Auth it means Open Authorization. Now we will come up with the official web page here. Auth 2.0 it means which stands for Open Authorization. It is a standard design to allow a website or application to access resources hosted by other web application on behalf of a user. The best example for that you know Quora, Quora is question answer platform here and here they don't have the sign up option. You can directly go ahead with continue with the Google otherwise simply continue with the Facebook. It means without sign up they will be able, they, they are allowing for end user to access their application by using Google credentials otherwise Facebook credentials. Then in, in this session I will go ahead with the continue with the Google. Then we are going to use Google API itself. Then now we will start with the implementation. For that perspective, we will simply come up with the Spring Initializer and here we are creating Spring Boot application. This is Maven project, language as Java, Spring Boot version, we are using 3.4.0. The package name I am giving here com.stack. Now give the application name, application name I am giving here, this is Spring Boot OAuth example. Now refactor the base package, then packaging a jar, Java version 17. Adding dependencies. We require here dependency as a spring wave and one more dependency we are adding here auth. Then this is auth two client we are using here. Then once we added the dependency, simply click on generate. Within minute, production ready application will be available there. Then simply copy the application and paste in particular folder. Now we'll simply extract our application here. Once the application is extracted successfully, then we'll copy the path of our application and coming to IntelliJ IDEA to import the, our application here. Then simply come up with the file. There is option available new project from existing sources and we are giving the path of our application here. Then click on OK. Then this is Maven project. Trust project with new window. I want to open in another window. Once it open here, then coming to SRC main resources and here we have available optional properties but anyway we are going to use the ML file then simply right click on resources new file and the file name we are giving here ml file application dot ml either you can give yml otherwise yaml as well then once we create the ml file the ml file contained you can simply copy it from our github otherwise our description box then here we require the client ID and client secret. For that perspective, I will demonstrate separately how we are going to create the client ID and client secret. Now we'll simply come up with the com dot full stack. This is our base package. And here we are creating the new package and the package name I'm giving here controller. The controller package is created successfully. Now we are creating new Java class and the Java class name we are giving here application controller. Now annotate with at the rate rest controller. We are using here at rate request mapping and here we are giving forward slash as API. Then first API we are writing here gate mapping. This is API I am giving default API. This will be public or response entity and we are giving the type as string. Simply say hello. Here we are returning string type of message. That's why I am using here return response entity dot ok and passing message as Welcome to full stack Java developer Pune. We are just returning here string type of message. Next API, we are writing here gate mapping, and here I am giving the API name as contact us. This is our API name contact us. Now public again, this is response entity we are using here return type it will string, and here I am saying contact this is our method name now it is written response entity dot ok and here we are returning string type of message the message I will copy it from my local yeah here we are returning the string type of message perfect this will be done with our API creation now we'll start with our uh, Google console activities for auth perspective then simply come up with the Chrome browser again here and here you can simply type 
गूगल डॉट कॉम देन टाइप हेयर गूगल कंसोल वंस यू ओपन दिट गूगल कंसोल हेयर देन हेयर आई ऑलरेडी गिवन सम स्टेप्स यू कैन सिंपली फॉलो दो स्टेप्स लाइक स्टेप नंबर वन गोज टू गूगल देन टाइप गूगल कंसोल देन ए पी एंड सर्विसेज देन क्रेडेंसीज क्रेट ऑल क्लाइंट आई डी क्लाइंट आई डी राइट या देन हेयर विल कम अप विथ ए पी एंड सर्विसेज देन वी हैव ऑप्शन अवेलेबल हेयर क्रेडेंसीज For that perspective, we need to select here our project. Then project I am going to create. This is first time I am creating. Then simply go ahead with the new project. And the project name I am giving here Earth example. You can give any name of your project. Then simply click on create. From here we need to select our project as well. Once project is created successfully, then we'll select the project here. option is coming here select project simply select the project once your project selected the project also coming here and then click on config configure consent screen next this is external application user type click on create then application name i am giving here auth example then here we need to give the email id Same mail ID I am passing here as well. Yeah. Now simply click on Save and Continue. Again, go ahead with Save and Continue. This is default. You can simply select Save and Continue. And then coming to back to dashboard. Now simply click on Credentials. And here you can click on Create Credentials. and this is auth client id we are going to select here because we are going to create client client id and secret application name this is web based application type we are selecting here web based application and name if you want to give the name you can simply give the name as well any name you can mention here then add the uri the steps will add from our notes see here i am using azure azure port number by default on cat then whatever you want you can simply mention this port number the next authorize redirect uri we are mentioning this is login perfect too now simply click on create and see within seconds it created the client client id and client secret and copy this client id and coming to properties file give here same next we require the client secret as well then If you want to download JSON, you can simply download. See, and there will be available client ID and client secret. Now simply click on OK. Then go to Maven, do the build up our application. And once build is success, simply reload the application and start the application. we are just waiting to see build success message there yeah our build is success see build success message available here simply reload the project and start our application now we'll come up with the chrome browser Simply hit here, local host, eight zero eight zero, app forward slash. What we are expecting? We are expecting it will goes to Google sign in page. There we need to enter the password. Yeah, here is it, Google sign in page. Then simply select the account, and then click on continue. See here is output coming. Welcome to Full Stack Java Developer, Pune. Now same, we'll try with incognito mode as well. There is not available any history. Then again here you need to enter the uh, username as well. Then username I'm passing here. This is Full Stack Java Developer, Pune. Then go to the next. We need to pass here password as well. Yes. 
again it will give us the output but it asking me for two step verification then verification code received on my mobile okay i'm just asking to resend it yeah i allowed from my side yes we are expecting the output will be there right click on continue and you will be able to say welcome to flustack java developer pune now we are very excited to see one more api we have created contact us api here is our output contact us api we are getting the result at the end and that's it in this session and if you're facing any difficulties then feel free to add your errors in comment box and thanks for watching this video please do like share and subscribe this channel to get more updates and see you in next video